28 years in prison for a rape conviction only to be acquitted. He is smiling because he's now out and getting a big financial payout for all that lost time. Today, the Colorado Attorney General granted an exoneration petition from Clarence Moses L. Our CBS4 investigator talked to him today and reports tonight from the Five Points area where that crime occurred. Rick? Jim, Clarence Moses L. was a very happy man when I spoke to him today. What a life he's had. Some three decades behind bars, and now he's to become an instant millionaire two times over. After 28 years in prison, Clarence Moses L. was given a new trial and found not guilty. Enjoy this freedom. <laughs> that you really don't know how much freedom really mean to you until it's taken away, and especially right when it's taken away for something that you didn't do. He was earlier convicted of raping and beating a woman after she had a dream about him. Now Colorado Attorney General Phil Weiser announced he will not oppose a petition for exoneration. A big part of the reason is that DNA was accidentally destroyed by Denver police. There is no, to my mind, reason we can't do better in this area. We need to do better, and that's what we owe. That's the cause of justice. This case is a travesty of justice. We reached Moses Zell by phone out of state once the exoneration was announced. Yeah, I'm just happy. I'm happy, very happy uh, with the end result that, that justice has been uh, acknowledged uh, and I'm being compensated. He described it well after being released from nearly three decades in prison. It's been a roller coaster ride, <laughs> for real. Sometimes I wanted to jump out the roller coaster. <laughs>